making my way to the main square right now because I'm going on a Game of Thrones tour. I'm so excited. I love that show. And if you don't, then you're wrong. <laughs> So today, Troy, Jeff, and I are on the walls of uh, Dubrovnik, which surrounds Old Town. Um, the wall was built in the 13th century and consisted of one drawbridge and two moats. This road used to be another moat. What? <laughs> Look at that water. We just learned that the construction of the wall started around the 8th century and <laughs> and wasn't finished until about the 15th or 16th century. That's insane. Hello everybody, I hope you are doing well. Um, I am currently in Split. Troy, Jeff and I all took a four, four and a half hour bus over here this morning. Um, so I just got to my hostel and I'm all checked in and I'm here for three nights. I might check out early though, we'll kind of see how the weather is. I think we're just going to go uh, do a little bit of shopping today and then we are going to go to a national park which name I don't remember, but I'll insert it on the screen here.
walking Troy and Jeff to the bus station tonight and then they are going to Slovenia and I'll be all by myself again. Good morning everyone. It is Thursday morning. It's about 8 a.m. Um, I'm just on my way to Kirka National Park which has a bunch of waterfalls. You used to be able to swim there um, but as of January of this year just to preserve the life there you can't anymore which sucks. is known for the Stradinsky book which is the longest waterfall on the Kirka River and it's also where everybody usually goes swimming but as I said earlier just due to the need to preserve the biodiversity that lives here um, they have closed it down and apparently that's also in part due to an accident that happened in 2019 so I don't know when it'll open again but yeah that's closed down right now So a little bit more about Kirka National Park. It covers around 109 square kilometers of the Kirka River and its basin. And it was only proclaimed a national park in 1985, so actually fairly recently. So to date, um, about just under 1,200 species and subspecies of plants have been recorded in the area. be able to swim in here um, and there would be like a, a Louise here to border it off but obviously that is not the case anymore. <laughs> Alright, hi everybody. Um, I am in the town of Skraden, which is like a 20 minute boat ride up from Kirka National Park. Me and my friend just had lunch and now we are hiking up these steep ass stairs to a castle which name I cannot pronounce. Um, yeah, we'll see if it's worth it. <laughs> So the Fort Tarina was built in Scraton um, around 1273 to 1312 and was built on the remains of a prehistoric hill fort during the time of the rule of the Liburnians. Good morning everybody. Today Amy and I are <laughs> doing a walking tour. Um, I think it's about an hour and a half and it takes us through the entire city of Split. So, yeah, I don't know how to end this. See you there. So the Golden Gate was constructed between the years 295 and 305 AD. The area that we're in is called Split, but it also goes by the name of Dalmatian, which is derived from the Illyrian word Delma, which translates to sheep country. The cathedral that's actually behind me was constructed in the 13th century. The currency that they use in Croatia is the kuna, and so kuna is actually a word for like wolverine. They have wolverines up in northern Croatia, and they would use the fur as a taxes, so that's how the word kuna came about as the currency.
finished our city tour and now we are doing a museum tour which actually includes the dungeon where Khaleesi locked up two of her dragons for misbehaving. <laughs> This particular hall is actually one of three reception halls in the western wing of Diocletian's palace and this hall was actually used to welcome members of the Roman Empire. to your last night yes. traveling for now. It's so yummy. After saying goodbye to my friend Amy, I spent the next four and a half hours on a bus going north to the town of Zagreb where I spent the evening with my friend Troy from earlier in the video. Obviously, we found our way over to a cat cafe as well. It doesn't make it easy. The next morning I got on a train to start my journey over to Ljubljana in Slovenia, which is where my journey continues, so make sure that you subscribe if you want to follow along. Okay, so I know that Kristen loves to give you guys lots of facts about where she visits, so I have the most important facts, the only ones that matter. Over here, they filmed Game of Thrones, and you pan to your left, over here they filmed even more Game of Thrones. <laughs> I Look was. like you're having the time of your life. I'm having the time of my life. <laughs> oh yeah, Game of Thrones is filmed there too. <laughs> okay, what country are we in right now? Croatia! 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 Cro